So Android 12 is around the corner. The stable release is coming very very soon. But what we know so far in Android version 12, some myths and some interesting features and a lot more things which you get in Android version 12. Let's just talk about the Android 12 things what we got right now till now. Everything we know so far about Google's next big update. A lot of changes are already included in beta 1, beta 2. There was developer previews were also available, developer previews 1, 2, etc. Will Android 12 really be called as Snow Cone? This is the major thing to think in mind. Android 12 is internally called Snow Cone, will be called Android 12. It's not Snow Cone, but yes, internally it will be called Snow Cone. Let's see how they will pronounce this. When is Android 12 releasing? It's still not confirmed. The exact release date is not confirmed, but we, we we might get the Android 12 stable update very very soon because all the beta 1, 2, 3, 4, even 4.1 was also released. The 4 beta was announced and it is done. Now we are waiting for the stable update. If you want to download the Android 12 beta right now on your device, you can because they already started rolling out this beta update for some of the devices, for example, some Google Pixel devices. It's also available as a form of GSI as if you don't know you can install GSIs on your device. There are options present for you Pixel 3, GSI, Pixel 4, GSI, etc. And you can even flash the beta 1 on all these all these following devices, etc. You can read out the article. Link for this article is in the description. In Android 12 beta, they got with platform stability. The features, etc. The features, etc. were quite amazing. You can see these features like lock screen, lock screen clock, and you have new material, you theming, material style wallpapers, a lot more things they've added in Android version 12. You want to know more about Android 12 features? You can simply get out from XDK. Will my device get Android version 12, which was also one of the major things to think about? Officially, the Google officially Google will provide this update to Pixel 5 to 4a, Pixel 4a, Pixel 4, Pixel 4 XL, 3a, 3 XL, and 3 and 3 XL. These are the devices which will get Android version 12, and these were the devices which are from Google. But if your device is from Xiaomi, Samsung, or anywhere, your device will also get Android 12 if your device is eligible with their custom skin of course and yes what's new with android version 12 and um, yes android 12 has some minor changes some major changes in ui they have changed a lot which everyone knows about that if you have used any kind of ported room till now on your devices or even gsi then you might got to know about these changes new lock screen with notifications ui custom lock screen clocks monet wallpaper based expanded theming system is just great dedicated one-handed mode scrolling screenshots and a lot more things they got some developer related changes which i don't think so is of any use for the normal public so yes we're not going to reveal that but right now we have some major theming changes which everyone knows about that so i don't think so i need to share these things but yes you can simply click on the link in the description to find out all these things in Android 12 beta or even Android 12 stable, you might get the material U, which is one of the biggest changes in Android version 12. So let's see how it will behave on your device. The design language is going to be restricted to Android and will be seen across a wider variety of Google services. It also has a wallpaper based UX theming. And what is that? This is the theming which I was talking about. Even when how the wallpaper has colors, the clock, which means lock screen clock will also be changed according to that wallpaper. That's quite interesting one. Also in Android version 12, you get some privacy dashboard related settings and honestly speaking, this feature is one of my favorites. There are a lot of extra features too, but this one is one of my favorite because it has a privacy dashboard. It will tell you that location is used by how many apps, camera is used by how many apps and microphone is used by how many apps in this past 24 hours. So it's just very useful by the way, even including that we have the new visual indicators which will tell you if your camera is in use or if your recorder is in use and yes, so yes, finally Google improved in the terms of security and privacy related things in the terms of quick settings panel as i previously mentioned you there are huge ui changes and major ui revamped and you can see it looks quite good enough some android 12 interesting widgets are also included and android 12 has new widgets this is unbelievable this is actually quite great because these things were not included in any android version till now what i know so far but yes it's good your privacy dashboard microphone clipboard read notification is also included and conversation widget you already know it also has this kind of new ui whenever you click on internet tile which is available in the quick settings you will see the wi-fi and mobile data both available here they've just included this and in my thinking i just don't like this honestly speaking 
you also get the quick tab but it is just limited to some device specific things as far as i know i don't think so it will work on your device the new volume panel was expected it's also included there you can see this vibration etc everything is present and also have this new calling indicator if a device has ongoing call or going on a status bar you have that indicator option available for you the new wallpaper and style i made a video on some port rooms for a mutual devices or redmi note 8 i made a video on those so make sure to check out that if you want to check out these features in detail or as i previously mentioned you wi-fi and mobile data same things available here of course the new setup is also included only these were things i just want to let you know these were things what we know about android 12 so far there are many more things to come let's just talk about this over the edge feel like i'm floating through the edge